What is up my crazy subscriber, this is JokingJaws84 here to bring us more Black Ops 3 multiplayer. Hopefully you guys enjoyed today's gameplay because today I will be telling you guys that I just discovered one of the best rushing classes here on the Black Ops 3 beta. Now, I do know once the Black Ops 3 full game releases in November, I know they're going to nerf the weapons and they're going to buff some certain weapons. So this is not like for the whole ride. This is just for the beta. So we're like currently waiting on Xbox 360 or not Xbox 360, sorry, on Xbox One or on PC. You know, use this weapon right away on day one and you're going to be owning 24-7. I, I promise you that because most of the time I'll end up with a record with 40 kills and 10 deaths or 30 kills and 10 deaths. So that's pretty much good. That's a high KD right there. And if you're currently playing on PS4, I suggest to test out this weapon right away and add the attachments that I will be telling you guys tomorrow. There will be a best class setup for the CUDA, which is the first SMG to unlock. And I will tell you guys you know the extra tips the extra information that you guys need to know in order for you guys to be successful with the cooter and i think i just passed an enemy while i was flying you know towards that hallway that was super weird sometimes you know my peripherals don't work so yeah nah i'm just kidding with you guys it does work 100 percent i just i just skipped him because i thought he, uh, he saw me so i just kept on running it's kind of a mind game that i play sometimes with my enemies it's super funny it's hard to explain because this is something that rushers do half of the time like you you'll you'll pretend like you didn't see them and then you go back a hallway and they'll follow you and then you kill them like right, like right there because they follow you. You're not, you're not supposed to be, you're not supposed to play the follow game. You're supposed to play, you know, where you're trying to go. You know, that's how, that's how I play here in Call of Duty. So anyways, this SMG, I'm telling you, is going to be super beast when it comes down to 1v1 situations. If you're currently playing a tournament online right now, I recommend this weapon. This weapon will save you, you know, from close range combat most of the time. The only problem that I had with this weapon would be the uh, the long range, of course, because it's an SMG, and also a person lagging all over the goddamn place. Now, in this gameplay, you should be able to see that a few times. The person was using a specialist that had like a blue suit, so um, I'll point it out along the way who it's to, so I can tell you guys who it is, because that's the only person I had problems with. The rest of the people, the rest of the enemies, you know, it was pretty much of a straight up combat. If I miss my shot, I miss my shot, but you know. This one guy, pretty much I shot him first, and I died first. I was like, what the hell, bro? Fix your internet connection. And it could probably be a person from Mexico, because, you know, I live in Texas. I was raised and born in Texas. And we're right next to the Mexican border, so, yes, I have faced a lot of people from Mexico, and there are tough motherfuckers over there, and I'm telling you, the optics should be faced somebody from Mexico, because they're, they're really organized over there. It's just that a lot of people don't see that, because, you know, most of the Call of Duty players play in the north or whatever. So anyways, back into the main topic, you know, the SMG CUDA is beast. That's all I'm going to say. It is beast right now. Test it out. Unlock all the attachments. Tomorrow, get ready for the best class setup because this weapon is going to make you sneak behind the enemy lines, flank him, take him out with ease. Um, I'm still missing one perk though. I'm still missing the ghost perk because that one's going to help you out even more. I'm flanking out the enemy and, you know, pursue the enemy from behind. It's just that one piece that I'm missing. And once I unlock that one piece, I'm telling you, I will be getting like around 60 kills per game. So, um, it's, it is an unnecessary piece because if you want to increase your KD, that is something to have. And if people complain about it, let them complain. Do not worry about people telling you, oh, Ghost is just a baby shit, you know, that's not, that's not cool. Let them be. They're the losers. You're winning. You're the one getting all the kills. So, do not worry about people telling you that you're using Ghost. I used Ghost like in Modern Warfare 3 and I ended up going like around 50 kills per game. That was a, a lot of good history right there, man. Modern Warfare 3 was beastie. So, um, anyways, yeah, you know, the CUDA best class setup tomorrow, today. And I'm telling you, this weapon is beast. I did have another gameplay where I managed to go 44 and 11 on Demolition. It's just the freaking PS4 only recorded 3 minutes of it. I might actually put only the 3 minutes and then, you know, pretty much combine it with some other gameplay that I have out there with the same amount of time. So you guys can see that the weapon is just super beast. And I was using this attachment. This attachment's in the weapon. And I'm telling you, it was a great 1v1 beater. So um, if you're like one of those people that love to rush in maps... This weapon, it is a one weapon to have on your on your collection. It is a one weapon to have. So, um, I'm telling you, just trust me. This weapon is going to own 
everybody from close quarters. You should see that right now. That's the person right there. That is the person that lagged me out more than half of the time. The one that I just killed at the end. I should be able to come out in the final ca kill cam, which is kind of weird. I mean, there was like a whole 30 seconds like in front of it, and still nobody got the kills. And as also, as you can see, I got 33 confirms. So I was actually the only one playing on my own team. I carried a whole team of noobs. Yeah. So before you start, like, um, you know, kind of, you know, doubting me, I just carried a whole team. And I got a lot of confirms. So that's it, guys. Guess one of more strategies and tips about Black Ops 3 Beta. Make sure you subscribe for more.